Okay, so we're given a histogram and we're asked to estimate the amount of rocks that were greater than 15 kilograms. So I'm just going to draw a line up from 15 kilograms and we're looking for greater than, so my arrow would be going this way, like so. So we're looking for everything that is in this region here and in this region here. Okay, so to work this out, I need to work out what the frequencies of those regions were, because we're asked for the amount. So, uh, looking at the class width of our first rectangle, um, we're going from 15 to 30, so that's going to be a width of 15, and our frequency density is 0 0.8. So, to work out that one, we're going to do 0 0.8 times 15. That's going to be for our first uh, frequency. And this second rectangle is a class width of 20, reading from the bottom. And its height is 1.2. So to work out the frequency, again, we're just going to times them together. So I'm going to do 1.2 times 20. And then I'm just going to add those frequencies together. So I can do this with or without a calculator. I've got a calculator handy, so I'm going to use a calculator. And I'm going to type that in, and it gives me the answer of 36. So my answer is 36. So it's important here to realize that um, to get the frequency, um, you times the frequency density by the class width. Now, be careful, because that's not always the way, because sometimes it can be proportional to the frequency. But with no other information in this question, we assume that it is equal to the frequency.